my coffee. Wait, oh, my coffee, coffee, coffee. <laughs> Hello. Welcome to the first vlog of 2024. Is it too bright? I don't know. As you can see, I'm doing this one in English and I decided uh, since it takes like, it doubles basically my editing time making the subtitles. So I decided to go for it and do my vlogs in English from now on. So yeah, today is a kind of chillax, relax, self-care day. I have my hair mask on. I got these for Christmas. Uh, they are like a uh, repairing one, nourishing one, moisturizing one. I've got the nourishing one on and this cute <laughs> pink towel. <laughs> and then we are going to be drawing. I've got this uh, Sennelier. I believe it's pronounced um, oil pastels that I bought like two years ago or something and I've never tried them um, I've never used oil pastels before don't judge me <laughs> I am really not that good um, I mean I love to draw I used to love drawing when I was a kid I used to like draw and fall asleep while drawing and as a teenager as well I never really made it a thing i guess so this year i decided to make it a thing or make it a habit of mine or a hobby of mine uh like properly this time so yeah here we go oh this is better yeah hello before we get started i want to add some clips i've already filmed this year um kind of like what i've been up to kind of thing so yeah First of all, I got a bird cage. Am I like weird like down here? Should I? <laughs> oh, tilted a bit, yeah. At first, I filmed the day I got my bird cage. Or oh, our bird cage. Um, yeah, I haven't had birds since I was a teenager, so pretty excited. But yeah, I'll add the clips here. Ta -da! I've got a bird cage. I'm standing on a chair. <laughs> I love the roof. I think it's so vintage. -y. I absolutely adore the shape. And the bottom part is actually brown, which is like perfection. And this fits perfectly on the on the dresser uh, in the hallway. I've been thinking, what should I do with that dresser? It doesn't look right. Something's missing. Here it is. It was this one. This was missing. Uh, yeah. Woo! Amazing. Bara -ba -bara. <laughs> but yeah, the lady who was selling the birdcage uh, actually decided to give it to me for free. Thank you, sweet lady. Really appreciate it. After the birdcage thing, I went for a nice lunch and I filmed that. So I'm gonna add, it, add the clips here. But yeah, uh, last week we had a very wholesome, I think it was so wholesome, uh, museum date with one of my childhood friends and her toddler, and then me and Olivia. So we, like us and our toddlers, and it was so, wholesome i think the kids were holding hands at some point and it was just just so cute and then there's the painting called Daistelevat Metsot. i don't know what mezzo is in english so uh yeah but olivia <laughs> olivia calls the painting the chicken painting and it's so cute and then i've been making mood boards kind of like instagram mood boards today if i have time i'm going to make like the, the mood board i've al already started it i'm not going to show it to you uh because i think the biggest dreams and goals should be kind of your own secret at least at first because not everybody around you has the best intentions always so you know they might make you doubt your dreams and decisions and so on so you know move in silence <laughs> and do your thing and you know keep it a secret for a while so unless you have like the best and the most loving people around you then just by all means oh yeah now let's get on with it so um disclaimer <laughs> i am not that good honestly honestly like honestly um uh, i kind of have um uh, kind of 
potential to be uh, decent, I would say, but I really haven't practiced at all. Uh, <laughs> you know, don't judge me. I'm on honestly, honestly. So please don't judge me. I'm just, I just really want to make this my hobby because I really love creating. And uh, yeah, I've got these papers. I have a grey one here, uh, like this one. Um, and then I've got this like burgundy type of brown color paper. Well, we'll start with this one. At first I was thinking about like a, like something easy to sketch, like a landscape or something. I've got this, oh, what was that? This card. This was a gift for my grandpa's cousin. It's a, uh, Book. It's a uh, Finnish art in 1800s. Um, and most of the pictures are actually black and white. <laughs> I would use like this one, like these. I bet these have beautiful colors. Well, they are black and white. These are von Richt. Do you say von Richt or von Richt? Or how do you say it? If you know, please help. I still don't know. <laughs> I've studied art, but I still don't know. <laughs> On the next page is actually one of my favorites. It's the Ripuvia Sorsia, Hanging Ducks, um, which is actually, actually, which is in Ateneum. Should we go for a landscape or should we be brave and go for a human being? <laughs> I don't know. I do have like, a, these are the colors that I have. There's like skin tone color. Green, two browns, like a dark brown, a lighter brown, and red, and a deep dark blue. But I think it's so important to really invest in yourself and your dreams and kind of just your own well-being. I think it's like, a, well, obviously, but I don't know why I never, like, a, I don't know, maybe it's perfectionism or something. Because I am the type of person that has to be, like, the perfect, like, right away. So, <laughs> and I know, I know it's not, like logical in any way but I'm sure some of you might um, resonate with that one <laughs> trust the process trust the process I have no idea what I'm doing I just like slap it all <laughs> I'm not sure if I'm not sure if I'm going to show this one. Oh man. Have you tried something new this year? Do you have like some resolutions or something like that? I'm going to talk about it a bit more in a, another video. Well, last year was pff, the hardest year of my life, basically. <laughs> it truly was. But I learned a lot about myself, about other people self-worth and all that this might actually work oh my god i mean it's uh it's still like a beginner level <laughs> type of thing but you know i like the way these work but yeah oh the battery is flashing oh no okay <laughs> we'll be back oh my god guys <laughs> I promise not to laugh. This doesn't look anything like the painting I was uh, kind of using as a reference. So this was just like the uh, reference as like the skin tone and all that, but it didn't, I wasn't trying to make it look like this because I don't like make it look like this. So I was just trying to make a person. Hello. I was just trying to make a person. So I'm pretty happy with this. It's don't laugh, it's not supposed to look realistic uh, or anything. Look, it kind of looks like a person. Like obviously it's not perfect, but it's, I like the mouth. I kind of like the more sketchy style anyway, but could you please focus on that? I kind of like the mouth. This is my first try. So yeah, pretty happy with that. It's not, it's not I'm fully aware that it's not like a uh, very beautiful. And I know that the kind of the, the shadows and everything aren't like 
but I used like half an hour for this. So I'm really happy. Really happy with it. <laughs> just, you're like, oh. <laughs> but no, I'm really happy. And this was actually an accident, but I think it suits her. What do you think? If I keep practicing real hard, I think I could get quite good. I want you to know that I fully know that this isn't like glorious or anything, but I'm just like, yeah. Oh, I'm excited. This, this is fun. I want to try something different. Lesson of the day. Just go for it. Just try it out and you might just like it. <laughs> I also found my old poem, po poems, poems, yeah, poems yesterday when I went to the Sinebrikov Art Museum the other day. Uh, I bought a little, little uh, uh, notebook for writing poems. So uh, it's like a, going to be a really like doing things that I enjoy kind of year 2024. I want to try to draw a whole kind of uh, landscape with this red color. I have this for my kitchen counter. This kind of landscape. I could use this. I'll use this as a reference with this one. I'm just winging it. I'm just winging it with this one. Yes, this was quite a few posts. <laughs> Some people have been like, why do you always find such good stuff in uh, like such cheap prices? And um, why can't I find and blah, blah, blah. And, and it's like, uh, why do you always have like such like cute stuff? <clears throat> I remind you of these are oh the battery's flashing again. Okay. When you learn what you want, you are looking for what you want. Then you don't like settle for something that you don't want. When you go thrifting, you are not looking for like everything. You know what you are looking for. And it's also uh manifesting. So if you are like um like the dollhouse I got for my daughter, I hoped for a dollhouse. I made a, a Pinterest board. And then my uh, cousin uh, happened to give it for free. It's also about manifesting and asking uh, for the things that you'd love. Boy, <laughs> battery. Oh. If you know the kind of world you are building, uh, you know what kind of stuff to get, and uh, it's easier to find the kind of stuff for cheap prices because you know what you know what you're looking for. Hey, <laughs> the battery is flashing again. So I'm just gonna end it here. So I uh, hope you are having a lovely start for the year. I'll see you soon in the next one.